Let's watch the assessment and intervention scenario, hypoglycemia, using a Lairdal simulator. At 12.10, EMS is dispatched to an 18-year-old male feeling weak and dizzy at a softball tournament. Upon arriving at the scene, the paramedic does a quick scan to ensure there is no danger. She introduces herself to the patient in order to assess AVPU and ABCs while placing a hand on his shoulder to comfort him and the other hand on his wrist to complete a rapid radial pulse check. The paramedic also notices the patient's skin is cool and clammy. After questioning the patient about the history of present illness, she obtains the patient's sample history. Recognizing the time since the patient's last meal and the exertion of playing sports, she suspects a hypoglycemic event. A complete set of vital signs is obtained, including lung sounds and a blood glucose level. After placing a 3-lead EKG, a normal sinus rhythm is observed. IV access is initiated and D50 is administered. The patient is reassessed, including a second blood glucose level, to see if the D50 has helped. With an increase in the blood glucose level and the patient reporting feeling much better, the ER is notified of an incoming hypoglycemic patient. She then reassesses the patient, including repeat vital signs. Arriving at the ER, the patient's care is transferred to the staff. Totally elapsed time for this scenario, 20 minutes. Time out, 12.30. Now let's go to the simulation lab, where you can use your skills to perform a patient assessment and demonstrate the appropriate interventions.